You can't teach an old dog new tricks. Hey, don't believe that? You just need the <laughs> right approach, man. Uh, good news. You're not on your own. The Nebraska Humane Society has brought back their tricks class. Pet behavior specialist Kathy Ganan returns along with uh, Mary's new friend here. Why are you holding the dog like Cause, this? Because this is Mary's how I hold like action. A, like, a, like a baby. Yeah, this yeah. is how I hold action. Who and is he this, seems Kathy? To like it. This is Rudy. Rudy. Hi, Rudy. Rudy's some sort of a terrier mix. He's about a year old, a little bit more probably. He was a stray, so we don't know a whole well, lot about him. But yeah. wherever so far, he was, he was loved. Yes. He's so oh, mild. He, he is. Yes. And he's, he has just everybody. It's like he's he's known yeah. him forever. He's been uh, how, visiting with everybody. How old did you say? A little over a year, probably. A little over a year. Oh so my goodness. Yes. Young, yeah. yeah, he's young. I young love guy. him. Uh -huh. I really do. Dog. I love you. He's very I, sweet. I wonder if Action would like a brother. Ha have you spent much time with him? Does, Just does this he morning. Do, does he, he know has, any tricks We haven't had him for very long. Does he sit? Does he well, we, we, we've been working on sit this morning. He does That's kind of a nice thing. He doesn't. Um, oh, hi, bud. But hey. tricks per se, he doesn't. But I, he catches on pretty quickly. He's a pretty smart little boy. And he's so, well, I Is he potty trained? I don't know. No. Oh. He might be easy to train just because yeah. he's not all over the place. Right. And he's old like enough. He could be focused. And whatever house he would go to, he would have to, mm -hmm. you know, you have to show him which way he needs to go out. What is he, about 30 pounds? He's a snuggler. Probably. Something like that. Yeah, and he's full grown. Mm -hmm. So what kind of home do you think he'd be a good fit for? Um, I think we may have had him for no kids under six, just mm -hmm. because he can run pretty fast. He might knock them over. Uh -huh. um, but he rode beautifully in the car. He's... He walked all the way in here, going to greet everybody on the this, way in. And this, a it's a perfect age to take a, a puppy home. Oh, because, yeah. I mean, he's still a puppy. He is. But yeah. you're not going through the, the infant but, stages exactly. with as, the puppy. As Mike said, the training of yes. like, the, where they the exactly. The hardcore training, you know what I mean? Yes. That's like having another baby oh, in your house. It is. He so just the, needs reminders as to where he needs to go out and those kinds of things. But he's kind of a ready-made mm -hmm. dog. The um, the tricks class, we mentioned yes. it. You brought it back. We did. Was that a popular demand response well, or what? It is. We kind of we alternate it with the um, out on the town class. But it's a little too cold to be out on the town right uh -huh. now. Yeah. Get a little too dark at night. So, so. what do dogs uh -huh. learn in tricks? All kinds of things. We'll learn some basics and teach you how to do like you know, shake and roll over and those things. But then we'll also do different tricks that you can learn with your dog um, with, say, a yoga mat. Or a push light. As in, like you do yoga and your dog. You teach your dog how to unroll the mat, bow, oh. all those kinds of things. Oh. So they can learn oh, to do a little bit. Fun tricks. Yes. And then what like, were you saying? Turn it, on a light? Yeah, or? those push lights that you push, the, push them. Uh -huh. We teach them how to do those also. So you can even hang them light on a wall at their height, teach them how to push it with their nose, or if it's on the floor, you can push out their paw, huh. put them in a closet. <laughs> They can go turn and the light most on the dogs can learn. I mean, I would mm -hmm. think only certain breeds might do well with those things. It just depends. Mm -hmm. more, it's more personality how, than anything. How long Some does the class run? How long does it take to? It's, it's what, four how, weeks. Four weeks. Four weeks. So, so if I bring my dog in, you're gonna, it's gonna be able to do something. Oh yeah. You think so? Absolutely. After four weeks? Oh absolutely. Uh -huh. Some of the basics. It's they need the basics under their belt, you know, to know the. They basic have stuff. to take that class yes. first, so there it's is a, a prerequisite. Class. Yes. Uh huh. But they will learn and how to do things with um, their, a person. Learn how to weave through your dog. The dog can weave through your legs and. I love Learn dog how to tricks. Go around dog you. tricks yes. are fun. They're very fun. So yeah. when we see those videos online, I could teach Action sure. how to do the same thing. Sure. No. Yes. Can we? Um, a little bit and pieces. It will. Let's switch a little bit to, to microchipping. Um, uh -huh. What are the benefits <laughs> of micro? And, and mm. do most dogs get microchipped nowadays? How does that most work? Are, yes, most dogs and cats are microchipped nowadays. We don't send anybody <laughs> out that's not. Um, the nice thing about it is it's a great way to track your dog if, if they say they got out and their collar fell off and so they had no tags on them. Mm -hmm. You know, vet clinics, all mm -hmm. of our ACOs have scanners. They have readers so they can, that can read the can. chips. So then we can call the place and they can well, notify the people. It's very affordable. I didn't realize yes. it. It's 10 bucks per animal. You don't need right. an appointment. Nope. You bring the dogs on a leash, cats and carriers, and yes. you're ready to go for 10 bucks. Mm -hmm. You're in yes. and out. And you're in and out and just short order it's they yeah. we have a system down and boom 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 you're in you're out and that's wow. on december 8th so they only mm -hmm. do it periodically right we only uh, do about once a year that's the uh the next one so yes. if you've you've been thinking about microchipping take advantage of that clinic yes. and then for adoptions if somebody wants to bring rudy home if they beat me to him um <laughs> what time should they come to the humane society today they, kathy they can come fill out an application kennels open at noon mm -hmm. but you can go a little bit earlier than noon mm -hmm. that's how we got action there was a a lot of interest in him um, as we found out but we were there first, so we got to go to the meet and greet room first and then brought him home. So, so I always advise. Really, I think you're taking him home. Um, he's pretty Let me call awesome. your, let me call your hu husband. Does your husband know about this yet? No. Is he's he watching? out of the country. <laughs> he's out of the country. <laughs> Maybe the perfect time <laughs> to get a new right. dog. <laughs> Surprise. Uh, thanks, yeah, Kathy. Thanks for coming <laughs> in. Thank you. He just, he like, just, keeps, like, hey, sliding good. further and further down. <laughs> he's just he's so like relaxed. The new show mascot. Let's just leave him here. We'll just keep him here. Okay. Thank you, Kathy. You're welcome. So I'm ready to eat, right? Thanks, Kathy.